Hello YouTube, today I'll be showing you my top 10 favorite city tweaks. So, my top, no, at number 10, we have Home Safari. So practically what it lets you do is, you can have whatever your Safari homepage is to whatever you want. As you can see, mine is Google. There we go, and there's proof. So that's a good app if you just want to stay on that all the time. So number nine today is Note Me for Notification Center. So Note Me is practically a swipe. Oh, sorry, wrong notification. Note Me is practically a note in your notification center. So it's just a quick note, um, quick note place if you're in an emergency or something. So then now number eight we got NC settings. Alright, what NC Settings lets you do is the same thing, it's in the Notification Center. So, what it does, if you look here, down here, that there is what it is. That's NC Settings. Uh, um, on to number 7 already. Oh yeah, that's just a little show of the SP Settings on there too. Already up there. Alright, we're up to number 7 already, and number 7 is InfiniDoc. InfiniDoc practically lets you have more than 4, um, more than 4 apps or something on each page. So, right here, at the bottom bar, 5, there's 5 there. And you can also do it at the pages. Alright. Right after Infinity Dock, we have Gravity Board, and Gravity Board lets you do this. Practically, there's no gravity on your thing whatsoever. So that is a good tweak to have fun with. And if you want to activate it back to normal, you just press the home button. Alright, um, next tweak is color keyboard. Color keyboard is a tweak that makes your keyboard colored. So, we're going to select themes, go down, and let's say we want to pick this one. So you press that, press that little blue arrow next to it. So like, I would like to pick this one. And it will show you what it looks like, so you know what it looks like. And you just pick, so I'll pick that one, go save. But you have to respring your um, springboard, which I'm not gonna do. So already on number four, we have Wii Toolbox. What that does is let you get all these Twitter things, flashlight or whatever, Facebook, all that type of stuff. It's helpful if you just want to get into it real quick. In that camera, telephone, messages. Alright, now, yep, yeah, it's my Twitter. Yeah, alright, at number three, we have Display Recorder. So, what Display Recorder is, is what I'm using now. It pretty much lets you record any of your stuff that you want to record on your screen. It is my favorite tweak at the moment. Coming up at number two, we got Voice Activator. Voice Activator is an app that if you have an iPod Touch, you should know that when you hold down the home screen button, it comes up Voice Activator. With this one, you can own, um, add your own command. So right now, I'm going to put in this. Put configure. Then I'll go down to City. Studio right there. So when I do that, I'll go voice activator, and then I'll say open studio. But you can't hear me because I'm using the software. All right. So and there we go. It opens up studio for me. So yeah, that's my number two voice activator tweak. 
Number one would have to be this toy here. It's called Imperium. I forgot how to activate it, sorry, so I'm gonna go back to it. There we go. Imperium. Kind of lost it. <clears throat> Imperium's right here. So what pretty much Imperium is, you um just pick an activation, which that's mine. So what Imperium is, this is what apps are running at the moment. Like that you're just using, so you can delete them. You got Wi-Fi and all that type of stuff. Volume, brightness, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, um, location, flashlight, camera, power alert, song lyrics, toggle, rotation, Twitter, and Safari. And then on the next page, it would have all your apps. So I cancel. It has all your apps on the next page. And then the four at the bottom is your favorite four, so you can just pick them real easy. Um, yeah, so that's it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and comment for more videos. And, yeah.